Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna be doing a outfits inspired by my fall playlist. Music is a huge part of our lives and I love creating outfits that match. I have a lot of fall clothing pieces that I think fit perfectly with this type of weather. But first I'm gonna show you guys some accessories that are featured in this video that I'm gonna be including in each of the outfits. So all of these items are from Charles and Keith. Thank you Charles and Keith for gifting me literally such amazing items. Like when they came in the mail, I was, my jaw was to the floor because I was like what like they're just very perfect for this fall and just for everyday wear I feel like but the first items oh my oh my god no okay so these are white kind of like a cream color platform ankle boots and they're so perfect what I noticed is that it's a lot easier to walk in heels when they're platform when I put these on I was ready to go I was running up the stairs running down the stairs and I was fine these are so comfortable and they're so easy to walk on like definitely don't feel scared when looking at the huge heel because it's so easy to walk on I'm definitely gonna be wearing these a lot of concerts like I'm a concert girly but these are so cute for the fall these next shoes are the Rosalie furry leather loafers I'm a huge loafer girly so I got super excited when I saw that they have this like furry fuzzy collection so they have a lot of shoes on their website right now for like their fall slash winter collection where they have this faux fur just like fuzzy texture on their shoes and bags it's this beige fuzz with the black outlining around the shoe and they're so cute they're so like business casual you know like i feel like if i was going to like an importing meeting i'd be wearing these shoes and then the last item that they sent over this purse is the furry charlotte bag again the little fuzz at the front it's like a brown mini shoulder bag and it has the buckle in the middle with charles and keith on it and then you can unbuckle it and then the inside like i feel like this just fits like all of your necessities you know lipstick lip gloss phone and that's it that's all you need and it also has like the shoulder part but it also has like the chain you can make it into a little mini purse so it fits like kind of like by your stomach or you can make it long so that it fits like a shoulder bag and then it just like hangs you know it was really fun having like furry related items especially because i feel like that's just the vibe for this fall and i got super excited when charles and keith sent me over some goodies even though it's considered like their fall collection i could definitely see myself wearing it throughout the whole year so definitely go check them out i'll leave the link down below and let's get started with outfits inspired by my fall playlist so I picked out six songs for my playlist and created some outfits surrounding those songs like either based on the album cover or just like the overall feeling that I get when I listen to the songs or even what I would wear if I were to see these artists in concert like just match the overall vibe. Yeah, let's get started. The first song on my fall playlist is Perfect Blues by Hannah Bang. I can imagine myself like walking down the street, autumn leaves orange bright red leaves falling down and i'm just like jamming out with my headphones i just think of like fuzzy blankets a warm cup of coffee like a cardigan you know that kind of environment like you're in the dark it's like kind of raining outside and you're indoors and you're like drinking hot chocolate like eating marshmallows and so for the top i decided to wear this oversized knit cardigan that kind of falls off the shoulder and then a mini black skirt and then i did pair it off with the furry leather loafers and i also paired it off with the bag it gives that comfort fuzzy warm soft feeling especially with the furry of the bag and the loafers i'm sticking to this like neutral natural colors even though her album cover is blue i just felt like i wanted to give everyone a hug it makes me feel like i'm gonna go to like a coffee shop and like drink a cup of coffee and it's like snowing outside even though it doesn't snow where i live but you know i could just pretend i could pretend i'm in the music video Okay, this next song, oh, I had so much fun making an outfit based on this song because this song has been on repeat since it came out. Invitation by Junie featuring Geiko. The album cover of this song is black and white. It's like a picture of a doorknob. Oh, so I knew right off the bat that I wanted to do like a black and white outfit and I also kept in mind like What would I wear to his concert if I were to see him in concert? So for this, this is where the platform boots came out. This is the platform boots time to shine I feel like it fits the song very well like an invitation kind of like someone flirting and like wanting to spend time with someone else And so I just get this like confident feeling and so platform definitely gives me the sense of like self-confidence So for this one, I wore the platform boots and then I paired it off with a mini white skirt and then also a simple black button up like i feel like this outfit literally just looks like the album cover like i'm that doorknob i am that little invitation on the doorknob i feel like the button up makes the outfit very like casual and kind of sophisticated but then with the mini skirt and the platform boots it gives like this concert kind of feeling this is definitely an outfit that i would wear to his concert if i were to see him live which i was literally 
I was so close to seeing him live like last month and I couldn't make it so I couldn't go and I didn't see him. I wanted to create an outfit that represented confidence and kind of like sexy and like flirtatious which is the kind of emotions that I feel when I listen to the song like I feel like I could ask anyone out. I also wanted to make sure that the shoes were like a focal point and so I didn't want to wear something too long or something that'll cover the shoes because I do think the shoes are like basically the statement of the whole outfit. Like I feel like the boots really just give that confidence like you know what you're doing, you know where you're going, you know what you want. Like I should have been in the music video. I was supposed to be in the video. Okay, the next song on my fall playlist is Invincible by Omar Apollo featuring Daniel Caesar. This is one of my all-time favorite songs of his and so for this one, the album cover is black and white. Like it gives me kind of like loneliness and sadness. A lot more mellow and a lot more quiet and definitely like a sadder song compared to the others. So I knew I wanted to create an outfit that kind of represented either loneliness, sadness, just like a sense of quiet. So for this outfit, I decided to wear all black. I wore this velvet material black top and then I matched it with a velvet material long black skirt and then I also wore the platform boots in this one I wanted to give like mysterious girl walking through the city like bright red lipstick and like feeling like the main character for the Junie outfit I mentioned how the boots represented like confidence and just like a high self-esteem and I feel like for this one the boots kind of represent like another kind of feeling I still get this confident feeling with the outfit but I feel like it's a lot more low-key and just like more reserved I think this outfit is for sure one of my favorites that I made I I feel like it gives like a nice silhouette to the body and I just feel like a boss. I feel like I own like 10 houses. This next song is Get You Alone by Baekhyun. This has been just my overall favorite song since I was born. It's a lot more upbeat, a lot more groovy and kind of retro, but I still feel like I would listen to this more during the fall. So for this one, I did try to match the outfit according to the album cover. So he's wearing this like cheetah print leopard print top so i decided to wear this brown and beige floral top and then that already is a huge like statement piece like it already has a lot of detail so i knew everything else that i wore with it had to be either just like a solid color so then i just paired it with a, a mini skirt i also wore the fuzzy bag along with it and then i wore the fuzzy loafers as well and in the album cover beckon is sitting i think on a sofa and this i'm literally i'm sitting right next to him like i i was supposed to be in the video <laughs> I was supposed to be in the album cover. I really love this outfit. It gives me like coffee shop vibes and it matches like the color palette of the album cover. The song gives me like vintage, retro, groovy. And I feel like it is kind of danceable. So I think that this outfit really matches that. Every time I listen to the song, I feel like I could dance with every single person that I see on the street. Like I feel like this is a very movie moment. Like if I were to be wearing this at a coffee shop and then this song starts playing, kind of like the movies where the song starts getting louder and louder and everyone in the coffee shop is like starts dancing with each other. Like this is the scene that I associate with this song in this outfit. I think that deserves an A+. Personally, I believe. This next song is a newer song. It's Somebody by Dio. I feel like his album in general just always gives like a winter vibe, especially because his songs are a lot more mellow and softer. I just feel like I would listen to it more during the winter or during the fall. So the album cover for this is also neutral browns, beiges, whites, like very neutral earth tone colors. Although I did want to wear something like a top or bottom that was either brown or neutral, I thought that just wearing all black was the way to go, especially because I did pair it off with the fuzzy loafers and I wanted this to stand out more than what I was wearing for a top and bottom. So I just decided to wear this black baby doll top and then I paired it with the flowy lacy mini skirt. I feel like the song and the album cover was like super random, but it reminds me of like vintage dolls. Like if you were to go to like a small town and go inside a store and like just see a bunch of dolls like on a shelf. I don't know, for some reason it gives me that kind of energy. And so I wanted to give that kind of vibe as well, which is why I chose that like baby doll flowy top not as tight you know i wanted to give like a more softer silhouette more innocent toned down a person that is really to themselves because i feel like that's just kind of the emotion i get when i listen to that song and i also decided to wear the purse with it again to add to that brown color palette and i just feel like the loafers and the bag go hand in hand because they have that buzz to them even though they're each a different shade of brown or like a different earth tone i feel like they still go very well together the last song that I chose from my fall playlist is Commitment by Luna Luna. I have like a deep connection with this song and this song means a lot to me. I think I discovered this song through quarantine. A lot of the songs that I chose were a lot more mellow and softer, which I just associate with fall. This one especially, I think, just falls into the fall category. Falls into the fall. Get it? 
But yeah, when I listen to the song, I imagine myself like walking down a beach and I'm like dragging my feet and I'm like holding my shoes in my hand and just kind of like reminiscing and looking at the sunset. And there's a part in the song where they speak in Spanish. I love listening to Spanglish songs. Like they have a mixture of English and Spanish because I'm bilingual and I just like resonate with those songs a lot more. And so because of that, I did want to match the outfit with the album cover, but also like incorporate some kind of like Central American attire or like color palette to it. And I have seen this kind of attire in my own culture so for this outfit I decided to wear this long lacy white skirt and then I paired it with a fuzzy vest and then I also wore the platform boots again to giving this confident feeling and then to match the red of the cover I decided to wear this scarf this bright red scarf I think the red really pulls it all together and it gives me this sort of Hispanic kind of aesthetic to them I definitely think the boots are a huge important piece to them because with the skirt and the vest alone I feel like gives a much more reserved kind of person and I feel like the boots just kind of give like that pop like actually no like I am reserved but I will do what I want you know what I mean? And yeah, that is everything for this video. And thank you again to Charles and Keith for sponsoring this video and sending me these cute items that I'm very excited to be wearing. Don't forget to check out charlesandkeith.com to check out their fall and winter collection. Stay safe and I will see you guys in my next video.